Facebook has collaborated with extremely rich person globalist George Soros to enable the informal community to control races in the U.S. also, around the globe. On Thursday Facebook reported that they will utilize the Atlantic Council's Digital Research Unit monitoring missions amid races and other profoundly touchy minutes to guarantee no interfering happens in races. InvestmentWatchBlog.com reports, in plain English, they will intrude in decisions to ensure that no one else does. That is not precisely right, they will verify that as couple of traditionalist voices as conceivable are heard even by the individuals who want preservationist content, and that liberal, globalist, hostile to American commies get the dominant part of room on their stage. Who better for them to collaborate within the exposed quest for globalist control destinations than George Soros? Furthermore, with the midterm races up and coming and the 2020 presidential challenge coming into sea, the planning for the open outskirts, hostile to America gather to combine to gag out professional American voices couldn't be more advantageous. The counter-Trump, hostile to American Atlantic Council is subsidized by George Soros through his Open Society Foundation arrange. In making the declaration, Facebook said they were contributing vigorously to keep our administration from being mishandled amid races. That nearly sounds good until the point when you consider Zuckerberg's FWD.us is an open fringish promotion assemble that offers an indistinguishable political perspectives from their accomplice in the controlling of data, globalist gay org Soros. Their meaning of manhandle will absolutely be distinctive when seen with regards to liberal versus moderate data. Their announcement stated, today, we're eager to dispatch another organization with the Atlantic Council which has a stellar notoriety taking a gander at creative answers for difficult issues. Specialists from their digital forensic research lab will work intimately with our security, approaching item groups to get Facebook continuous bits of knowledge and updates on rising dangers and disinformation crusades from around the globe. This will help build the quantity of eyes and ears we have attempting to spot potential manhandle on our administration empowering us to all the more adequately distinguish holes in our frameworks, appropriate deterrence, and guarantee that Facebook assumes a positive part amid races all around the globe. Profound state is requiring wins in up-and-coming races to keep the diversion going, and the fantasies on the majority set up. Can't bear the cost of another misfortune like the U.S. presidential decision or the pedophiles will clearly get named in places past the profound web the blame diversion for Hillary's losses by all accounts heading off to the Comey spill about the 1% messages gave over by WikiLeaks. Where are the voices that got in Comey out a year ago? Why are they standing up now? Winged creatures of the same feather, will always flock together, who is in your flock? Soros is Clinton's greatest money-related supporter, email release that goes underreported. Messages spilled from extremely rich person George Soros Open Society Foundation demonstrate the level of impact he has on outside illicit relationships. Soros has given over $30 million to Hillary Clinton, making him her biggest money-related supporter. The prevailing press, in any case, has been quiet about the break. RT America's Alexey Yurashevsky has the report.